I'm here with Courtney Hornsby with the West Monroe Mayor's Minute, here to tell us about some happenings um, taking place in West Monroe. Courtney, thank you for being here. Thank you so much. And so spring is here, the weather is beautiful, uh, so far so good, and I know a lot of things are happening in West Monroe, including be beautifying the city. That's right. Well, it is spring break for uh -huh. most, most school children, and so it's a perfect week to have a couple of activities that we have going on. Today, the Wildlife and Fisheries Get Out and Fish Program stocked the pond at Caroli Park with 500 pounds of catfish. 500 pounds. Yeah, they just uh, did it a couple of hours ago. Yeah. We got to go watch. 500 pounds goes fast. It, 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 they got into the water quickly. And so if you want to go fish, we encourage people to do that. It's a dollar admission to get into the park. Mm -hmm. The park is open seven days a week, 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Of course, there's lots of other fun things to do at Coroli, but we know people love to fish, and this is a great uh, access for the public to do that. The point of the program is to get people who don't normally get out and fish to teach people, especially our children, how to fish. So it's a great opportunity to do that. We love it. And then also, uh, West Monroe is getting ready for the Clean City Award. It is. You know, we are the state champions mm -hmm. for 2021. We're going to try to repeat that title. Our first level of competition is district level, and we're judged next Wednesday, April 6th. So we'll be posting a route of that map. They have a very specific route they look at. We'll post that on our Facebook page, mm -hmm. but we encourage our businesses and our property owners to help the city do their part, pick up trash if you see it, weed your sidewalk areas, your right-of-ways, uh, keep your lawn looking nice, help us win that contest. Our city workers work tremendously hard to keep it clean but as you know it's difficult to do that with just a, a small crew so if yeah. we could really get the public's feedback and help we'll compete at the district level next Wednesday and if we win then we'll compete on the state level either at the end of April or in early May Oh, well, I hope I hope you win again. Yes, Everybody thank you. Everybody clean up their That's area. That's right. And tell me about the spring poster contest. Yes, so the city and Keep West Monroe Beautiful are hosting our annual spring poster contest. The theme is just ways to keep West Monroe cleaner and greener. Again, mm -hmm. a great springtime, spring break activity. We're asking all elementary children in grades kindergarten through fifth grade to enter, and it's due Friday, April 1st. You can drop them off at City Hall. You could have dropped them off at your school, but if you haven't done that, bring it to City Hall. Have your name on the back of it and how we can get in touch with you and there's going to be prizes awarded and we'll have those drawings on display in the lobby of City Hall throughout the month of April. Okay, and when will you announce the prizes in the winter? We're going to be doing that if we have our entries due on Friday. We'll be judging and probably within the next one to two weeks we'll have our entries named and our, our winners recognized. We hope to bring them to our April 12th City Council meeting and let them get recognized in front of the City Council. Wonderful, that'll be special. Courtney, yeah. thank you so much for coming on the show. It's great you. to have you. Thank you.